On July 29, 1014 AD, the Eastern Roman army, led by Basil II, defeated the Bulgarians at the Battle of Clydeum. This event marked the beginning of the end of the Bulgarian threat to the Empire. Emperor Basil II, who had waged a war against the Bulgarians, vowed to bring them under direct rule. His brutal campaign against them earned him the nickname of the Bulgar Slayer. When he was crowned sole emperor in 976 AD, Basil made it his goal to end the Bulgarian Empire. After 40 years of fighting, he finally got his chance when he met his rival, Samuel the Tsar, at the Battle of Clidion. A large Eastern Roman army, led by Basil II, marched from Constantinople and headed straight towards the western region of the Bulgarian Empire. In retaliation, Samuel sent a large Bulgarian invading force to attack the newly acquired Eastern Roman region of Thelus Lonica, but were defeated. Meanwhile, the Eastern Romans ran roughshod through the western Bulgarian countryside. The Bulgarians at first put up a brilliant defense, inflicting a large amount of casualties upon the Eastern Roman invaders until they were outmaneuvered near the village of Clidion. Basil's top general, Nikiforus Zephius, along with the emperor, led a charge against the Bulgarian defenders, which broke their defenses, leaving them wide open for the picnic. The destruction of the Bulgarians' defenses created a huge panic amongst the soldiers. Many of them fled their positions and were cut down by the advancing Eastern Roman army. Tsar Samuel and his son, Gabriel, who were watching from a safe distance, managed to escape by the skin of their teeth from the chaos of thousands of Bulgarian soldiers who dropped their weapons and fled from their defensive lines. Prince Gabriel, however, managed to rally most of the fleeing soldiers who set up a bloody ambush for the pursuing Eastern Roman cavalry which allowed his father Samuel and his entourage to escape back to the capital. Upon hearing the news that his pursuing soldiers were slaughtered in an ambush set up by Prince Gabriel, Basil II had his men round up the Bulgarian survivors and those who were either captured or surrendered, numbering over 15,000, had them blinded. One out of every hundred Bulgarian was left with one eye so they could escort the rest back home. The blinded survivors eventually made their way back to the capital of the Bulgarian Empire in Prespa. Tsar Samuel, upon seeing his blind army, reportedly had a heart attack, which would eventually kill him two months later. 